I mean, the interesting thing is, of course, dynasties um, make women very important. Women are very, very important in families. Um, we're all part of families. I mean, partly this book is a is a is a chronicle of the families. We're all we're all members of such families. Um, power families are a little different, and of course, because often. Um, the, the woman who was the mother of the, the the heir to the throne had immense power. And so that was how many women beca- came to power, either as widows or as mothers. The dominating, um, inspiring influence of um, the mother who loves her son is a theme of the book, of course. And, you know, um, when you look at many world leaders, they were given their confidence by brilliant mothers, um, not always to the to the benefit of humanity. I mean, Hitler and Stalin, for example, were classic examples of that. But, but, um, but in many of the dynasties, especially of the East, where places like the Ottoman Empire, the Mughal Empire, the, the Mongol Empire, there are incredible women who were clearly great statesmen and clearly great politicians, as well as kind of as well as devoted mothers. 